Okay, I thought of something to talk about. Ask FM. I don't know if you know what that is. It's basically a site if you don't know what it is. Where you can ask questions, but you can do it like anonymously if you don't have an account. So basically you can say whatever you want. And I love this site, but I hate it because I get a lot of hate. Like people are just like, oh you should just delete it. But I'm like, I'm not going to delete it because that's what they want. But I took pictures anyways to show you guys of some of the stuff like people say. Like, they call me like a whore. They think I'm lesbian. I don't know what that has to do with anything, but like whatever. Um, oh, they want me to like kill myself. Okay. Um, basically, if I was gonna kill myself, I wouldn't take advice from um, someone who like is on anonymous and doesn't even have like the I don't even know courage. <laughs> Not even courage because saying that to somebody isn't courageous. I don't know if you don't have the like guts to say it to my face, but yeah, here, here's some of it. I don't know if you can see it. There's that one. And I replied to it, and there's that one. And there's that one. So, yeah, I didn't really say anything bad back. I just kind of said, whatever, you know, you saw, you can see what I said. Um, there's another one, I didn't, there's some I didn't reply to, I'll show you. Um, okay, so I got, okay, this one's like really weird, like I don't even know how to, Describe this one. I'm just kind of like wondering who says that to a person. If I didn't leave it up long enough, I'm sorry. Just like pause it, go back, and pause it, read it. Um, I got another one. It said your face is distorted, but I don't know. Let me find it. Okay. And there's that one. So, I don't know. I guess what I'm saying, like, there should be some way to actually, besides like going to the police, they can track down anybody, I think. I don't know. I never go to the police. But like, there should be a way to like, track it down figure out who it is because if I knew who this person was or whatever I would just like tell them off okay like just go up to them and be like what's your problem why do you have a problem with me why are you posting on my ask why don't you have if you can post on my ask and tell me to like go cut my wrists and stuff and like tell me I'm a whore when you come up to me and say it to me it's because you're scared you're a coward if you think that you are so cool just sitting on your computer like people say things when they're behind a screen because they don't have to see the person's reaction or they don't have to they think they don't have to deal with the consequences but there are consequences for it like I'm just saying I'm not even just saying this to people who have been bullied I'm saying it to people who have ever done this to somebody don't do it because it's not a good idea and anybody who's been victimized I'm sorry but don't listen to what they say, especially if they're behind the screen, because they're not even worth it if they can't say it to your face. And even if they do say it to your face, like, they're, they're idiots. Because if, if you're dumb enough to actually say that to a person, you're an idiot. Like, you, nobody should ever just, like, feel so low that they should just, like, die. That should not be... I know it happens. I know people take their own lives, but it, sh it shouldn't be a problem. And there shouldn't... It shouldn't be people are the reason people are doing it. People shouldn't for like bully people so bad that they think the only way out is suicide because that's wrong. And like if I was like not so I don't know. I don't really care what other people think of me because like 
I'm not gonna change for anybody because if I don't like myself, how can I expect like other people to like me? Kind of thing. That's my. So if I change and then I don't like myself and a bunch of fake people like me for like a fake me, then what's the point? I want people to like me for who I actually am. And if you're gonna post stuff on my ask that's mean, I don't care. Go ahead. I honestly, I don't. But I just feel bad for people who aren't so like secure. Like they're very insecure and very like, they get bullied a lot so they just, it's bad enough for them, you don't have to go make it worse. Like I know, I know there's probably a lot of good people out there, there's probably a lot of people who've never even done this or anything. But I know there's people out there who have because it's happened to me. If it's happened to me, it's happened to other people. And I've seen it happen to other people, like one of my friends, they told her she was a crack whore or whatever and told her she was like a meth head and she's like she was freaking out about it I was like just ignore it it's anonymous I'm like come off anonymous at least if you if you can't say it to my face come off anonymous and say it please because if you're questioning asking me all these stupid questions they're not even questions they're like statements insulting me and you you don't even want to come off anonymous like you're not even worth my time it's a waste of time have to have a like I answer like a few of them, but I'll, I got a bunch of questions. I just delete them. I honestly be like, "Oh, you're so stupid and ugly," and I'll just delete it because I'm like, I'm not stupid. I know I'm not stupid, and I know I'm not like. I don't think I'm like the hottest or prettiest or most beautiful person ever, but I don't think I'm ugly. And even if I was, like, who cares? No, like, there's no such thing as ugly to me because it's like, even if you're not, if you don't think like you're ugly and you're like pretty, there's somebody who's gonna think you're ugly, I guess. But there's always someone who's gonna think you're beautiful. I guess, like, I think everyone's beautiful. I don't know. I always tell people, oh, you're beautiful because everyone's beautiful in their own ways. And it doesn't even have to be like, oh, they have a pretty face. They can be a nice person and they're beautiful because nice, niceness, niceness is good. And being who you actually are and being like true to yourself, that's always good. I just don't like when people are like pressured into being something they're not. And it's it's terrible like the fact that like try to if you have a friend and you think you're actually pressuring them and you're doing it by accident. Like if you're in a situation with somebody and just like think about it before you actually say anything because you might actually be pressuring them by accident. And you could be like you could be hurting people. Like, I've been hurt by a lot of my friends. Friends. Like, close friends. I don't know. I'm, I've, I've probably hurt them, but I've never, like, been told that I've hurt my friends. I try not to. I mean, I, I don't want to hurt people. That's, like, the last thing I want to do. And I know they don't mean to hurt me, so of course I forgive them when they apologize because they realize what they did was wrong. But it's not even just friends. Like, there's people who don't even, like, know me and they'll, like, insult me for no reason. Because they'll hear stuff and then they'll be like, okay. You don't know me. Don't judge me. Don't label me. Don't. Don't tell me who I am. I know who I am. You. I don't need people telling me who I am and how I should act and how I should be and what I should look like and what to stop doing and what to start doing to be better when I I already like the way I am it's like pfft, nah who needs who needs people telling me what to do I'm sure they all have flaws so why are they pointing out my flaws you can't point out my flaws and then they, like you can't nobody's perfect basically like <laughs> your thing you could be insecure about could be on your back literally like what if you have a big birthmark on your back and you don't like it it looks like a giant bag of potato chips all greasy on your back. Nobody can see it. But then I have like a scar on my face. Let's say I have a scar right here. But let's say I have like a giant scar right here. And everyone makes fun of me for it. It's like just because you can see it doesn't mean it's bad. And who cares? Really, who cares? Who cares what people look like? Who cares what, how people act? People have free will. They can do what they want. Like, you don't, you don't have to beat on people for being themselves. Everyone's like, oh, be yourself. But then, like, as soon as someone be some, like, is themselves, they're like, oh, my God, that person's so weird. That's how, like, a lot of people are. And I'm like, 
you just told them to be themselves, now they're being themselves and you're like, they're weird. No, they're not weird. They're original, unique, fun. Like, just get over it. Like, I guess that's it, because I don't want to make this too long. Um, yeah, I'll make you another video soon. Bye!